Marcos Freitas of Portugal for the title. I'm here, who've uh, well, Shanta, of course, has uh, rekindled those heights that he set a few years ago now when he was top 10 in the world towards the end of 2015. Season so far at the uh, the Europe Top 16 Cup event in uh, Montreux in Switzerland. Because that's an event. We reached the quarterfinals there. Former winner of that event, Freitas, of course, when it was uh, the top 12. Back in 2014, just before it switched, uh, expanded to the uh, 16 format it's in now. With all the younger players they've got, the likes of Nyanis Seker and Desai, who we saw here earlier in the day. Two guys with considerable experience. And quickly. There's a little push and turn and then able to wind up with the big forehand. That's a really a copybook play of his. Executed perfectly off the table the way he glides his movement so good That one. Game up on Sharaf Kamal Ashanta of India. Well, on that service, uh, Freitas again, uh, Ashanti not able to come up with the response to it. Freitas' forehand in this first game and a half. Rishanta as a, as a play, I think. I mean, there, that can hit. Actually, he's not getting the same kind of cheap points off his service. Done well there. Really a ton of form, albeit it's been early in the season and unfortunately the players are not going to be playing a great deal over the next few weeks either. Disappointing of course, absolutely the right decision by the ITTF to suspend play till the end of April. All sports across the world affected by the situation we're in. The enforced break. I hope you're enjoying it. Oh, by four in this game? Seven, three. He's taken five of the next six here. And he's gone on there. What a run in Muscat. Brought back to a game apiece in this men's final by Sharath Kamala Shanta of India. And 
taking eight of the next nine points to level this final up. Then we started to see more errors on the forehand, but you've got to give Ashanta credit for the way that he's stuck around in that game. More traffic coming into it now. Had an international level title for a while in their respective careers. A, a big week, big tournament for him. Because that's a hard tournament, but a first round at the Qatar Open. Rough get back to back wins together. Freitas locked up now, seven apiece. Oh, isn't it? How can this guy still do this? 37 years of age. Strike the ball like that. into the, the armpit area of the Portuguese. Yeah. Saves the... are opening up the table, but it took guts from Freitas to take that on. Irves. support he enjoyed that and it's taken it's a Amman open final to Sharath Kamala Shanta now with uh, how this final is going how he's if you like a bit of Shanta his composed elegant style problem solving lead that he's got at the moment 2-1 to think about here at this stage. Oh, and get foul service in a shunt to lead up to three now. finding the corner of the table. I know he's lost the point there, but I think it's a good play for Ashanta. Uh, timeout called here by the Indians. And Freitas. Uh, oh. 
Then pressure on Ashanta. He has the service. Pretty flat forehand for the Indian to take. See here, loading up with spin for Atis into the back. You've seen the replay on that. It's actually a very flat forehand, quite high tariff to take on to give him game point. Sharath Kamal Ashanta from the title here. Has to do about it, the top seed, 3-1 down, just as he was against Ashanta's compatriot earlier in the semis, Amit Desai, cakewalks, and he had to dig deep in that semi, can he do it again here? Lead up to three now. Good response this from Freitas to going 3-1 down. Particularly where the sixth went to 13-11 in the Portuguese's favour. Freitas was stronger in the seventh, no question about that. Fair has a lot more experience. Uh, sense he's going to be a tougher one to, to finish off here from this position. Freitas needing all... Good play again there, finding a bit of space for Atas and he's uh, ripped away with this uh, fifth game. Pressed to see him coming back from 9-3 down here, probably too much. To a sixth game here. Seven game points for the Portuguese. Each of the week at the ITTF Challenge Plus, Aman Open here in Muscat. Marcos Freitas, the top seed, still trailing. against Desai in the semi-final. I just think this is going to be a much tougher task because Ashanta, of course, is older, much more experienced, and then he's seeming here with a good advantage in this sixth, uh, Sharif Kamal Ashanta. And quick, not immediately benefiting from the timeout. It's a dominant point from the Indian, full of heavy forehands. So demanding to have to do that continuously.
sense. Third game point here for Freitas. Rock solid in the kill. In the match now here, the uh, third was 12-10 in Ashanta's favour. Of the table. In many ways, the closest Freitas has come to forcing a seventh. Well into that rally. Way to be going into it with a match of uh, this quality. We've got so many good names, so many quality players. Point again. He has done. Sharath Kamal Ashanta. I don't think he can quite believe it. He has won the ITTF Challenge Plus Oman Open here in Muscat. He's the champion. And boy, has he had to earn it. Many very shortly for the singles finals. The uh, women's final, of course, a little bit earlier. And the men's final that's just completed. Do you see?